Hey guys, it's Wishlist Wednesday and I'm bringing you Dollar Tree finds from all across the interwebs. Each week I put together a graphic like this to help me keep track of things that have been spotted that I need to be on the lookout for when I'm at the Dollar Tree next. As you can see, I've watermarked the image with all the original Instagram accounts who posted these pictures first. I've also linked them below, so please be sure to check these ladies out. First up, I went out to the Dollar Tree website and I saw that there were some, I guess these are fall socks that are available. I love the knee highs that Dollar Tree comes out with seasonally. They've got a cat, a fox, and some other cute stuff. And then I saw that these winter themed socks had been spotted. I'm probably going to get all of them if I see them. There have also been more L'Oreal products spotted. This cream blush was available, it's a limited edition, it was available in two shades. So I went out to the internet to see if I could find any reviews and I did find some on Makeup Alley. It looks like the public is generally just kind of split down the middle. I pulled up these reviews and I'm going to go ahead and put them on the screen. Feel free to pause whenever you see the icon if you'd like to read them all the way through. I also saw that these L'Oreal True Match blushes were available. It looks like two or so shades have been spotted. So I'm just going to show all the different shades. Feel free to pause if you'd like to look and see what the names of those different shades are. And here are the ingredients. Feel free to pause to look at those. I'm also going to pan over some of the reviews. So again, feel free to pause whenever you see that icon. There are also some new lip balms. It looks like they are probably Dollar Tree products. Um, Crystal, who is Miss Clearance, actually posted this picture and shared that these are potted lip balms that you stick your finger in, not the domed ones. They also have these e.l.f. blushes. These are from the studio line. I believe that I had this on a wish list some months ago, but I saw that they popped up again, so here they are again on my wish list. Um, I'm just painting over the different shade names, so feel free to look in that top um, rightish hand area for the names as I'm painting over them. Quite a few of these are out of stock, but it does look like this is not a discontinued product. So good news, if you can't find it at Dollar Tree, you could always wait for a 50% off sale and get it for $150. Here's a look at the ingredients. And here's a look at the reviews. This is the best of the best reviews. And here's a look at the best of the worst. I also went out to Makeup Alley to see what kind of reviews it was getting on that website. And they're generally positive, but there's a lot of feedback about the glitter that's in these. I went out and looked for the specific shade that was spotted at Dollar Tree, which was Fuchsia Fusion. They also had a 50 ounce-ish milk container. It's made of glass, it's lidded. I thought it would be very cute for the fridge, so I'm gonna be on the lookout for those. And then lastly, this Ricky Lake book was spotted. It's got a foreword by John Waters. Um, so it seems like that'd probably be a pretty cool read. She's had a very interesting life from what I can see. So I'll be on the lookout for that one. There's some information about the author. There's some reviews. Feel free to pause whenever you see that icon to read those through in more detail. And here's a better look at the best critical review. So that's it guys, here's another look at the image. Please comment below and let me know what's on your wish list this week. Thanks so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out my Instagram, Glossary of Tags.